welcome to the 99th year of the Scholastic Art and Writing Awards. The Scholastic Art and Writing Awards were founded in 1923 and for nearly a century have inspired bold ideas and creative teams throughout the country. This is the 27th year the Shack Art Center has been hosting the Scholastic Art Awards in for teens in Snohomish County. I'm Rachel Ulmer, the Education Director at the Shack Art Center, and I'm delighted to be here tonight, virtually kicking off this celebration. Tonight, you join the ranks of notable Scholastic Award-winning alumni, such as Andy Warhol, Zach Posen, Stephen King, Lena Dunham, John Lithgow, Luis Jimenez, Robert Redford, and now you. I'm so delighted you all had the courage to put your creative selves out there so we could share your extraordinary vision. I want to thank the educators, families, and friends and students that supported them throughout this creative process. I want to thank jurors who donate, donated countless hours of their time carefully examining your work. I want to thank the volunteers and staff that helped with all the tasks associated with Scholastic, hanging the show, processing submissions, checking in artwork, and more. Most of all, thank you students for allowing us to be part of your creative journey. No matter what award you receive today, it is your voice and your visual narrative that makes this time in your life important. Expressing your dreams, hopes, and fears, thank you for being vulnerable and for sharing your art with us. You are extraordinary. This is your celebration. Welcome. I'm Judy Tui, Executive Director of the Shack Art Center. Thrilled to have you here with us today as we celebrate the Scholastic Art Awards and our uh, annual Susan Jane Russell Scholarship Award. A little history about the Shack Art Center. We're a, a, an organization that's been around a long time. In fact, we were started back in the 70s with a small group of people who wanted to have an arts presence in Everett and to support visual artists. And then in the 90s, it grew a little bit bigger and we began, this is when I was on the board, and we began to really look at art education as a real need in our complete in the entire county. And so we started with Scholastic Art Awards, which is now 27 years we've been providing this wonderful opportunity for our students. Um, and we also started our senior scholarship that in that same time frame. And so from there we've developed and grown our education programs and we're we're thrilled to be able to provide so much for our schools and teachers. Today we're going to celebrate specifically our Susan Jane Russell Scholarship Award. And today we're giving out $5,000, which is the greatest amount we've ever given. We are so thrilled to be able to do that. But a little bit of history, I'd like to talk to you about Jane, Susan Jane Russell. We named the scholarship for her because of everything she had done for our organization and for education and students. First of all, she was one of the founding members back in the 70s of this very organization. And then in the 90s, she was the catalyst for the Scholastic Art Awards to start happening. If it wasn't for her, we may not be here today. And then she also, as she later in years, she said, we need to give more in our scholarship. So she single-handedly raised money. She donated it herself to grow our endowment so that today we can give out $5,000. So we're thrilled with her, we're, we miss her dearly. Her legacy is with the Shack always. And today now I'd like to introduce her daughter Harper, who's here from Portland to give out our awards. Hello everyone, my name is Aiko Simzak. I'm a full-time working artist here in Denver, Colorado, where we are right now in my studio, my home away from home. And I am just gonna talk to you guys a little bit about what it's like being an artist and show you guys some of my work and um, you'll get to know me a little bit uh, in this presentation. 
Um, but first off, a little bit of a backstory about me. I'm a Glacier Peak alumni. That's where I went to high school. And then I went to college at Cornish College of the Arts. And I received my bachelor's in fine art. And I majored in photography and minored in painting. Um, I also started a company about three years ago called Coco Collab with my partner. Her name is Corinne Trujillo. And we work on murals, we do paintings. Uh, we also work with some other artists. We're all about collaborating and uh, connecting community with creativity as well. Um, so yeah, I guess we will just go ahead and dive right in and I will show you guys some of my, my work, my paintings. Cool. Here is the most recent project that I worked on down in Miami, Florida for Art Basel. And I collaborated, it was myself and Kryn Trujillo and AJ Davis. Stop, let's dance, stop, let's dance. Just bring the beat back, bring the beat back, back, bring the beat back, bring the beat back, back, bring the beat back. This was the first mural that we ever painted together as Coco Collab, and Coco Collab is an artist duo, me and Corinne, and our mission is to reflect the times of the feminine essence through the use of universal languages and cross-cultural imagery. Um, we like to use a lot of color theory, ethnically ambiguous portraiture, and archetypes to accomplish that, and we kind of uh, mesh together our travels, our heritages, and our personal stories that depict the modern woman's mind. Here are some publications that we were in this year and a little bit of last year. And I guess I, uh, I just want to give a huge shout out to Scholastics because I remember when I received my first gold key and my silver key and it just gave me that extra push to keep going and keep pursuing and I had, you know, a support system and then I went to college and now I'm making art full time and I am extremely grateful for all of my experiences and this life is truly incredible and I couldn't be more grateful for it. Thank you everybody for tuning in. I'm truly grateful for this art life that I live and I couldn't do it without the support um, from 
everybody and now all of you. So if you'd like to give my page a follow on Instagram, it's at IcoYugo. And then the company that I run with my friend is at Coco Collab. And thank you guys so much. And I feel very honored to be a guest speaker and talk to you guys about art. So happy Scholastics. Woo! Hey everyone, my name is Zhang Hen Li. Last year, I received the Bernie Weber Memorial Scholarship. I'm currently attending the Rhode Island School of Design and doing different projects for my foundation year, including a variety of drawings, paintings, and woodworking projects. The opportunities at RISD have shown me my capabilities as an artist and also how much more I have to learn. And to any of you who are planning on or have already applied to an art school, it's an experience that is tough, but I believe it will be rewarding in the long run. I'm planning on majoring in industrial design in my sophomore year, but as my teachers have advised me, I'm keeping my options open for any other fields that may spark my interest. I'm still wondering what I want for my future, and I'm sure many of you are wondering the same thing. My advice to you is to be diligent, do something you enjoy, and stick with it. I want to congratulate all of you who participated in the 2022 Scholastic Art Awards and wish you the very best on your future endeavors.